Repair Clinic encourages you to perform this procedure safely. In this video, we will show one or more of these icons to alert you when to use caution. Before you replace the gearbox on your edger, first make sure the engine has cooled. Next, remove the wire and boot from the spark plug to prevent the engine from accidentally starting. Use a T25 Torx bit screwdriver to remove the three screws securing the blade guard. Pull the guard off. Next, unthread the screws securing the gearbox assembly. Slide the assembly off. You're now ready to prepare the new gearbox for installation. Use a screwdriver to help prevent the blade from rotating on the old assembly. Then use an 11 16 inch socket to loosen the mounting nut by rotating it clockwise. Unthread the nut, then remove the washer and the blade. Now use a 5 8 inch wrench to secure the adjustment arm and swing arm retaining nut as you use a half inch socket to unthread the shoulder bolt. Pull off the adjustment and swing arms and remove the bolt and washers. Next, remove the screws securing the adjustment plate to the old gearbox. Align the adjustment plate on the new gearbox and replace the screws to secure. Confirm that the washers are on the shoulder bolt, then insert the bolt into the new gearbox and slide on the swing arm and adjustment arm. Thread on the retaining nut and tighten. Position the blade on the shaft. Slide on the washer. Thread the nut. And tighten to secure. Confirm that the gas tank is in place on the mounting posts and that the bumper is in place on the tank. Then position the gearbox assembly. Rethread the screws to secure the assembly. Reposition the blade guard and secure it with the screws. With the repair completed, reattach the spark plug wire in boot and your edger should be ready for use.